So why did 95% of mountain bikers switch to e-bikes? The answer lies in the combination of power, endurance, and the sheer thrill they offer. E-bikes are revolutionizing the way we experience mountain trails, making them accessible to more people and enhancing the adventure for seasoned riders. Here are my top five picks for mountain trail adventures. These e-bikes are designed to tackle the toughest terrains, providing you with the ultimate riding experience. First up, one of the most talked about e-bikes, the Cannondale Motera Neo 4. This e-bike has garnered significant attention for its impeccable design and performance. But what makes it so special? Let's start with the technical specifications. The Motera Neo 4 features a Shimano EP8 motor delivering an impressive amount of torque. This motor ensures you have the power to conquer even the steepest climbs with ease. The 625 WR battery provides a range of up to 125 kilometers, allowing for extended rides without worrying about running out of juice. The bike's frame is constructed from Smartform C1 alloy, making it both lightweight and sturdy, perfect for rugged mountain trails. Now, let's talk about the suspension. The Matera Neo Free 4 comes equipped with a RL silver suspension with 150 millinoids of travel. This ensures a smooth ride, even on the rockiest paths. The bike also includes four piston hydraulic disc brakes, ensuring reliable stopping power in all conditions. But how does it perform in real-world scenarios? We gathered some user experiences to give you a better idea. Users rave about the Matera Neo 4's stability and control, especially on technical descents. The precise handling allows riders to navigate tight corners and rocky sections with confidence. One user mentioned that the bike's robust frame and advanced suspension system made a noticeable difference in comfort and performance during long rides. They appreciated the smooth ride and the bike's ability to absorb shocks from rough terrain. Another rider highlighted the bike's impressive battery life, allowing them to explore trails without constantly worrying about recharging. They also praised the motor's power, which made climbing steep hills feel effortless. Overall, the Cannondale Motera Neo 4 stands out for its combination of power, durability, and advanced features. And whether you're an experienced rider uh, or new to, to mountain biking, this e-bike offers a thrilling and reliable experience and is priced around five to seven thousand dollars. So, well, what do you think? Is the Cannondale Matera Neo 4 the right e-bike for your mountain adventures? Let me know in the comments. Let's move on to my next pick and shift our focus to another contender in the e-bike world, the Orbea Wild, the most awarded bike in the EMTB industry. This e-bike is making waves for its exceptional performance and impressive value for money. First, let's talk about its power. The Orbea Wild is equipped with a Bosch Performance Line CX motor, similar to the Matera Neo 4, providing a robust amount of torque. This ensures that steep climbs and challenging trails are no match for this beast. There are two battery options. Choose from a 750 watt hour or 625 watt hour battery, both offering an extensive range, which means longer rides with fewer stops to recharge. This is a significant advantage for those who love to explore vast mountain terrains. The frame of the Or Be uh, Wild is constructed from hydroformed aluminum, making it both lightweight and incredibly durable, perfect for the rugged demands of mountain biking. Now onto the suspension system. The Orbea Wild features a Fox 38 float performance fork with 170 millimeter of travel ensuring a smooth and controlled ride over the roughest trails. Braking is critical when tackling mountain trails and the Orbea Wild doesn't disappoint. It comes with Shimano XT4 piston hydraulic disc brakes, offering reliable stopping power in all weather conditions, but how does it perform in real world conditions? I gathered some user feedback to give you a comprehensive view. Riders have praised the Orbea Wild for its exceptional handling and stability particularly on technical sections. The bike's geometry and suspension system allow for precise control, making it easier to navigate through tricky paths. One user shared that the bike's lightweight frame and efficient motor made long rides feel less strenuous. 
allowing them to cover more ground comfortably. They also appreciated the bike's ability to maintain speed on flat sections and descents. Another rider highlighted the value for money that the Orbea Wild offers. They were impressed by the high quality components and performance capabilities, especially considering its high price point of $12,000. In summary, the Orbea Wild stands out for its balance of performance, durability and affordability. Whether you're a seasoned rider or just starting, this e-bike promises an exhilarating and reliable experience. What are your thoughts on the Orbea Wild? Let me know in the comments below. Next up, let's explore my third pick, the Freedare Saiga. This e-bike is gaining attention for its remarkable affordability without compromising on essential features. First, let's discuss the battery. Easily recharge your e-bike with a portable locking battery pack that can either be locked onto the frame or stored separately. With a 960 watt hour battery capacity and torque sensor, more power is saved during each ride. Pedal assist allows for easy cruising up to 90 miles per charge. It's a great way to enjoy the ride without worrying about running out of energy. This capacity is more than sufficient for daily commutes and weekend adventures, ensuring you spend more time riding and less time recharging. The frame of the Freedare Saiga is made from high strength aluminum alloy, making it both sturdy and lightweight. This construction ensures durability while keeping the bike easy to handle, even for beginners. Now onto the suspension. The Saiga features a front suspension fork with 100 millimeters of travel, which is perfect for absorbing shocks from uneven roads and trails. While it may not match the advanced suspension systems of high-end models, it certainly enhances comfort and control for everyday use. It is also equipped with Kenda Fat tires, suitable for all terrain, including sand, mud, snow, roads, trails, and more. Kenda tires are high quality and guarantee your comfort with each cruise. Price is under $2,000. You would really have to search hard to find this kind of high value for $2,000 elsewhere. Very competitive, but is very heavy compared to other bikes at 79.3 kilos. So it would be harder for smaller riders, or if your battery fails, it would be a tough ride. But what do users think about the Freedare Saiga? I gathered some feedback to give you a real world perspective. Riders appreciate the Saiga for its excellent value for money. Many have noted that despite its lower price point, the bike does not skimp on quality or performance. This makes it an attractive option for those looking to enter the e-bike world without breaking the bank. One user mentioned that the Saiga's motor and battery combination offers a balanced performance, making it suitable for both urban environments and light off-road trails. They also highlighted the bike's ease of use and straightforward assembly process. Another rider praised the bike's affordability, stating that it provides all the essential features needed for a comfortable and enjoyable ride without the high cost associated with more premium models. In summary, the Freedare Saiga stands out as an affordable yet feature-rich e-bike, ideal for those who want to experience the benefits of e-biking without a hefty investment. Whether you're commuting to work or exploring local trails, this bike offers a reliable and enjoyable ride. What are your thoughts on the Freedare Saiga? Could this be the budget-friendly e-bike you've been searching for? Let me know in the comments below. Next, we're turning our focus to the Aventon Adventure 2, a robust and versatile e-bike that's making waves in the market. Let's dive into the specifics of its speed, range, and payload capacity to see how it stacks up against the competition. First, let's talk about speed. The Avent Adventure 2 is equipped with a powerful 750 watt rear hub motor capable of reaching speeds up to 28 miles per hour with pedal assist and 20 miles per hour using the throttle alone. This makes it one of the faster e-bikes in its category, perfect for those who crave a bit of adrenaline on their rides. Now onto the range. The Adventure 2 battery provides an impressive range of up to 60 miles on a single charge. This range can vary based on factors such as terrain, rider weight, and level of pedal assist used, but overall it ensures you can cover significant distances without worrying about running out of juice. Payload capacity is another crucial aspect, especially for those planning to use their e-bike for commuting or carrying heavy loads. The Aventon Adventure 2 boasts a payload capacity of 400 pounds, which includes the rider and any additional cargo. 
This makes it an excellent choice for riders who need to transport groceries, gear, or even an extra passenger on occasion. The Adventure 2 also comes with a sturdy aluminum frame, front suspension fork, with 80 millimeters of travel, and fat tires, making it well suited for a variety of terrains from city streets to rugged trails. Its versatility and durability are key selling points for those looking for an all-around performer. But what do users think about the Aviton Adventure 2? I gather some feedback to give you a real-world perspective. Users have praised the Adventure 2 for its powerful motor and impressive speed, noting that it provides a thrilling and efficient ride. Many appreciate the say, extended um, range, uh, which allows for longer adventures without needing frequent recharges. One user mentioned that the bike's payload uh, capacity is a game changer, enabling them to carry heavy loads with ease. They also highlighted the bike's stability and comfort, even when fully loaded. Another rider commended the Adventure 2's versatility, stating that it performs exceptionally well on various terrains, making it a reliable choice for both urban commuting and off-road exploration. In summary, the Aventon Adventure 2 stands out as a powerful, versatile, and reliable e-bike offering impressive speed range and payload capacity. It comes in at $3,000. Whether you're looking for an adrenaline pumping ride or a dependable commuter, this e-bike has you covered. Could this be the e-bike that meets all your needs? Let me know in the comments below. Lastly, we're diving into the Rad Rover 6 Plus, an e-bike that promises outstanding performance without breaking the bank. Let's explore what makes this e-bike a budget-friendly powerhouse. First up, let's talk about the price. The Rad Rover 6 Plus comes in at a competitive price point of $1,099, making it a fantastic option for those who want to experience the thrills of e-biking without a hefty investment. Despite its affordability, Rad Power Bikes has not compromised on quality or performance. When it comes to the motor, the Rad Rover 6 Plus is equipped with a 750-watt geared hub motor, delivering robust power and torque. This motor allows the bike to reach speeds up to 20 miles per hour, providing a smooth and exhilarating ride. Whether you're commuting or exploring trails, this motor ensures you have the power you need. The battery is another highlight. The Rad Rover 6 Plus features a semi-integrated lithium-ion battery, offering a range of up to 45 miles on a single charge. This impressive range ensures you can enjoy extended rides without the constant worry of recharging. Now let's discuss the design and build. The Rad Rover 6 Plus sports a sturdy aluminum frame and front suspension fork with 60 millimeters of travel, offering a comfortable ride on various terrains. The fat tires provide excellent traction and stability, making it suitable for, uh, for both urban and off-road adventures. But what about the user experience? We gathered some real-world feedback to give you a better idea. Users have lauded the Rad Rover 6 Plus for its exceptional value for money. Many appreciate the powerful motor and, and long battery life, uh, noting that it offers features typically found in more expensive e-bikes. One user mentioned that the bike's build quality is impressive providing a smooth and comfortable ride even on bumpy trails. They also highlighted the bike's reliability and ease of use, making it a great choice for beginners and experienced riders alike. Another rider praised the Rad Rover 6 Plus for its versatility, stating that it, pours, it performs well in various conditions from city streets to rugged paths. They emphasized that the bike's affordability does not come at the expense of performance or durability. In summary, the Rad Rover 6 Plus stands out as a budget-friendly e-bike that delivers on performance, quality, and versatility. If you're looking for an affordable e-bike that doesn't compromise on features, the Rad Rover 6 Plus is definitely worth considering. What do you think of the Rad Rover 6 Plus? Could this be the e-bike that fits your budget and performance needs? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more e-bike reviews and tips. Until next time, keep riding and enjoy the journey.